glad you asked. I actually do like Death Battle. It's one of my favorite YouTube channels. See, I look at Death Battle solely for entertainment nowadays because of the fact that the matter is is that sometimes with these matchups, they can get a little bit skewed. See, for me, it all depends on who they match up. See, when I look at a fight between two different characters, I look at four things. Feats, form, ability, and power. Then after all that is established, does the outcome make sense? Some of the best fights in Death Battle were always fair and they made sense. Iron Man versus Lex Luthor, that makes sense. The outcome of Thanos versus Darkseid, this also makes sense. Doomsday versus Worldbreaker Hulk. Sam Fisher versus Snake. These are the type of fights that have common sense with them, so they're like, oh well, yeah, that makes sense with the outcome, but that's usually with video game and comic book characters though. But then they pull crap like Green Lantern versus Ben 10. Green Lantern is very powerful, no one's disputing that, but he should not have been able to defeat Alien X. Or putting Thor versus Wonder Woman knowing damn sure she can't be killed without a piercing weapon. Then it just comes down to common sense. If you take a god and then put him up against a very competent man who has a lot of skills, that god is winning 10 times out of 10.